Hi everyone, uh, thanks for checking out my channel. I'm going to have a look at uh, natural gas now, uh, what could be ahead of us and what will be uh, what happened over the past week. Also, so um, stated in previous uh, videos, still um, hard time for short positions. Uh, that did actually attempt to trade um, the cycle and the shoulder shoulder um, season uh, didn't really work well so far with some major bonds we got from 246 you know, up to almost 3 um, which was definitely not expected by many but that's uh, basically where we are so the question is are we seeing you now some loss of momentum that could actually trigger uh, a serious move to the downside so we're having that reference uh, trend line on the daily that we're having seen here uh, on the last push we get on that uh, rising wedge we're now having also divergence in place that's that one is a little bit uh, narrower and not calling for major correction uh, but only looking at 290 to actually support the price so potentially not meaningful uh, but the large one of course is a bit more uh, with some room to actually break slightly above three uh, if we look a bit closer the four hours is actually setting also quite a nice uh, divergence we're having a very nice engulfing on that rejection at three that happened uh, last week um, which could be pointing to a reversal also showing a potential double top uh, for that short uh, period here at three somewhere alongside that line but that point here could actually trigger something a little bit uh, more sig significant in terms of the downside so if you look um, at the fundamentals um, we're having some indication that the LNG export did actually reduce uh, either this is only a temporary thing or this is more a long-lasting thing uh, will remain to be seen but if that the case and we start seeing drop below uh, 10 um, then we could be back to more, some more normal price as the, the price was mainly supported by this uh, most recently so um, that's something to keep an eye on uh, a bit early to actually draw any conclusion yet uh, but I think the scenario where we still having many gaps to close, uh, I think there's uh, at least that one here that's calling. So that one would sitting at 270, which is rather high. Uh, but we, of course, having that one here that's never been closed uh, properly uh, here that's calling for 215. Uh, I think at that point of time, it's almost as really clearly not possible to actually say. Uh, if we're going to clearing or filling now uh, ahead of summer that seems a little bit unlikely now so we need to see how we go but that's um, rising wedge we're having here should we see that one broke, breaking uh, could see some acceleration to the downside really quickly uh, and I think a reasonable target that we could have is at least to fill that gap here at 270 then we should actually find some support there uh, if we look now at the court report, uh, not actually much in there. Uh, we can see open interest was not really big. Um, the swoop dealers did actually uh, reduce the short exposure, um, reduce actually the long exposure, sorry, by reducing uh, short. Um, and uh, no, sorry, back again. They increased the, uh, the net long um, positions by reducing. Uh, short so that's that's definitely uh, bearish as a covering against uh, lower price the managed money was quite neutral but they're still adding some long position um, during that week it was quite a neutral uh, setup between 296 that did actually close almost uh, the same level so again another accumulation week uh, but uh, nothing very um, very bearish we're still having some traders that are actually accumulating shorts uh, and the retail traders i think are getting pretty much confused like many are i think with that market at the moment so i guess at that point we we'll just need to watch and see how we go should we actually start breaking above three um, something significant then definitely we'll have that trend line here at 3.14 that is um, that will be the next uh, resistance level to watch so yeah that's about it uh, thanks for watching i uh, wish you safe trading and i speak to you soon cheers bye